Hi guys and welcome to the channel. My name is Q and this is a quick video preview of Xbox's Remote Play. Uh, so I have the Xbox beta app on my Android phone. I have a uh, Pixel 3 XL and I have my Xbox One X um, and then I you had to enable the remote play. Uh, I'll use another video to kind of show how to enable that. But this video is just a quick off screen to kind of see how it functions. Um, pretty much it's, it's like remote desktoping into your Xbox. Uh, so it, it, in a way it mirrors, um, you know, the what's happening on the Xbox onto your phone. Uh, and based on the off screen footage that I've recorded, uh, it looks to be fairly fast. Uh, if, if there's any type of lag, it's probably in the uh, milliseconds. Um, but um, the game that I, I booted up here to kind of uh, test it is uh, Hot Shots Racing. So I've never played this game before, first time playing it uh, since I downloaded it off of Game Pass. Uh, so I was still trying to get used to the controls and the drifting. But here's uh, some off-screen footage of this. Uh, look forward to another video where I can kind of show how to enable the remote play on the Xbox through the settings uh, and yeah and all you have to do is download the um, the Xbox beta app uh, and sign in onto your phone and I believe this is also going to be available on iOS and some of you guys might be thinking how are they able to do this if uh, xCloud is not available on iOS well the app itself is uh, is not streaming the games from the cloud this is streaming the games from your device that you own in your house to your device so I believe because of that they're able to uh, be able to be uh, an official Xbox app on the iOS and Android store uh, that does this because because pretty much like I stated earlier this is almost similar to uh, for people that are on PCs when you remote desktop into like a remote computer and you're able to see and kind of control everything um, you know remotely uh, from afar so think of it in that sense with this mobile app that's on your phone so if you want to play games in bed without having to boot up your Xbox and you have this app you pretty much uh, um, you know um, can utilize this so it gives you a little bit of a switch functionality um, so I can tell you right off the bat the the video stream coming through the remote play is very fast I, I couldn't see uh, just from my you know, regular human eyes that there's any type of uh, latency or lag from that. But I can tell you that the controller, I have an Xbox controller that's Bluetooth into my phone controlling this video feed, that there there was a little bit of lag in the beginning through the menu system. But when I got into the game, um, there was really no lag in terms of acceleration, controlling and steering. Uh, if there was, I, I, I wasn't able to kind of feel that. I was able to feel it outside of this when I was going through the menu system and moving the the cursor um, you know um, around the different icons and you know making my selection I did notice a little bit of lag there but that could be uh, more about the Bluetooth because I do have a ton of wireless all around my house so it's it's my uh, controller Bluetoothing into my Android phone that's next to my Xbox that's also on so I'm wondering if, if that is causing the latency but uh, you know um, who knows we'll have to kind of test that later on but uh, I'll shut up now uh, enjoy the off-screen video to kind of show what remote play is all about and uh, you know I hope Sony brings this uh, to the PlayStation 5 because I would love to do this on my PS5 as well uh, with the Sony app on on either an Android or iOS phone so all right guys enjoy uh, comment below and if you're new to the channel subscribe uh, definitely would like to make more content um, around gaming and uh, just just love talking you know gaming overall so thank you